What's up guys? So to start off this video, we are going to in and out to eat a little bit, meeting up with the boy Mikey, and then uh, we're gonna get the uh, bumper appraisal done again at a different shop and see how much they'll give me. So I'm really looking forward to that because the Cobra needs definitely some work done on the front bumper, sadly, and I mean, it needs to be fixed for sure. Oh my God, I can't do this with one hand. What we're gonna do today, and then uh, we'll update you guys on the process, so I'm looking forward to it. Hopefully they give me a good deal to get the bumper fixed because it's really been bothering me. And uh, it needs to be done, especially on a car like this. And I love to keep my paint in gray shape and I hate to see it in bad shape. So it's obviously like, hey, what am I gonna spend my money on? And uh, what is insurance gonna cover more than anything? So uh, we'll catch you guys in a little bit. So if you guys have been updated with the channel, uh, you guys would have known that we actually added a GT500 to the, the HH race lineup, and we're really excited about that. It pops though. But it's a little hot right now. Might turn on the AC for the one time. But it feels really good. The weather is definitely cooling down, and uh, Cobra feels good. Trans still having slight issues i was beating on it but something's still not right sadly so i'm gonna have to fix that asap We'll be starting to make merch this coming week. I don't know, I'm hoping by maybe next week it should be for sale. So inquiries will probably be, be done or I might have an eBay link or something. I might make my own website at, the end, at this point. I think that's our best bet. So we will see about that. And uh, I'm gonna be coming out with fresh, fresh designs, all right? this more than just a merch type of thing I mean don't get me wrong I think it's cool to have merch which that's the whole point it's gonna show Alex SVT but I want to wear apparel that will show like kind of just like who you are you know like mix it up the first drop is obviously gonna be just Alex SVT showing the car represent me you know that'd be badass I appreciate every one of you guys that watch the videos and uh, should be pretty badass that you're supporting the channel but this tune but hopefully then if i get a dyno tune this shit go away like i'm hoping if i get a dyno tune like the pops still remain there i'm hoping that's just the nature of the car but at the end of the day it does come down to just it being a tune
to bring it over here. Hometown buffet. It's probably a transmission issue. That's how it looks. <laughs> Stay in the shade right here? I'd prefer a Lamborghini smell over a dirty rag. <laughs> That's how it starts. It looks good though. Man, my boy Renee. It looks fresh. I'm not going to lie. It looks good. He looks like a t -shirt. I know. <laughs> <laughs> In the Shelby. Dude, it looks badass, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> oh, he wants the Cobra's keys for a collateral. Yes, for sure. Clutch grabs at the very top. I do like the sound though. What do you think? First impressions, it feels good. The first gear feels kind of low key for the two time. I mean, it don't feel bad, but, you know, I don't know. If my cousins. It sounds really good, actually. What do you think? The it has a nice tone. Yeah, it does. And the wine is loud, too. Oh, the, the wine answer. is loud. Where is he going? <laughs> How was my recording? Uh, oh, on the trip? Yeah. It was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. How was, uh, how was my interview? How was my working interview? It was great. I mean, you know, we made the trip. We're going to go, right? Uh, we gotta make a U turn. Okay, so right yeah. in the immediate U turn. Yeah, so. Yeah. I like the tone. It still has the cat, so it's still pretty, like, has that wine that's really loud still. I don't know. It's pretty cool. What, uh, if, what if he goes like high flow cats? It would just still have. Still legal, but. It's still legal for the most part, yes. You're definitely right. Because you want that good balance of. Dang, the Cobra looks hella mean, though. I'm not gonna lie. I wasn't a big fan of this body style, but it actually looks really aggressive, I'm not gonna lie. Set up on it, huh? Yeah. I wonder what gears are in this car. Transmission's good. I'm a big transmission guy, and obviously, something life doesn't want to treat me right with a good transmission or, or clutch. What do you think, Mikey? You like it? Yeah, I, mean, I only drove it like for five seconds, but. Yeah, I mean, it's smooth. It's it good. Hey, that shit sounds way neater from the outside than from the inside. Oh, the exhaust on this? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was saying. It the sounds, car it's, it's loud. It sounds nice from the outside. When I'm inside, I feel like it's too quiet. No, yeah, it definitely is. It sounds way different when you're outside. How's the transmission feel? Huh? How's the trans feel? cool. All right, for sure. I like it. In the car. <laughs> you just need a short shift there and you'll be killing. Yeah, chilling. Should be good. about this one it has like a, a clean wine you know yeah. like the term is like hella like crazy but you do have a smaller pulley though you're right you're right have you ever heard it with a stock one nah it sounds definitely slower for like it sounds like a weaker wine you know like yeah. my hair's cool right, i'm taking off my shoes for this we're in different territory. There you go. So go ahead. Okay. Well, let's let's do a little do a little version. yeah do a little intro in there. So, all right. So we are in Renee's 370, 350, 350, 350Z. Okay. What's the the 370 is like a little bigger or what? It just comes with a, a wider body and like 10, 15 more horsepower. Okay. Well, this already off the bat feels really light. Like it's not bad at no. all. But I guess it grabs really good. Yeah. So I guess we'll see. So these are my roots right here. There you go. <laughs> you're you're <laughs> stupid. Push down, and then that's reverse. Back. Okay. So you say it grabs hard. Yeah. So if reversing is cool. Okay. Going forward hard. There's definitely something wrong with mine. Then, if my is supposed to hold a thousand horsepower, there's something wrong with mine. This shit. It grabs. It grabs. So. Oh, 
you definitely feel that grab. Yeah. Just go left. Yeah, go left. Let's see it. It's not as fast as the. As... Yeah, I definitely it think. Grabs. Yeah, <laughs> like you can hear that chirp. My <laughs> don't do that. It feels good. It's not bad for sure. It's nah. really good. For a little Z? Yeah. Oh, yeah, enough, to, enough to get hard. sideways. Yeah, yeah. So if your shit don't feel like that, then no, if that's yeah. what it's supposed to feel like, then yeah, your car is way off the marker. It definitely grabs how I think a clutch would grab. Yep. You know, well, that's good to, to feel like what that kind of feels like, so I can kind of put in perspective. Put in perspective what? Because like, I didn't know you had like I thought that was a stock clutch oh, that came no, on. That's like thousand horsepower rated, like, and it don't feel no close. That's like. It, it, it's light. I'm telling you, it felt like a stock clutch. Like, oh, that's yeah. why I, 